Hello and welcome. Uh, this is a tutorial based research channel and uh, basically um, I'm here to help you um, start researching yourself. Um, it's the best way to get uh, some real answers uh, for yourself. Um, makes things, uh, gives it a bit more clarity and uh, reality to it rather than uh, entertainment-based uh, stuff, which you see a lot of. Um, okay, right, today, if you are interested, um, go and have a look at the, the early videos. Um, the reason I say that, um, like I said, uh, it shows you the research in, in action, and uh, it helps you understand, it helps you focus, gets your brain um, uh, adjusted to to what we're doing, what I'm seeing, um, and what is out there in our in our colonized solar system. There's no two ways about it. So I say alien in the title, and um, all be revealed. Uh, it's something we've been looking at through the through the videos, um, trying to understand how um, the images are made up. Um, and similarities between the various moons and planets and stuff. Um, and of course, the Earth is one of the solar system's planets. And uh, I think there's a, a lot on Earth that uh, we are missing. And um, I think uh, there's a lot of answers about the solar system to be had right here on our own Earth. So, let's go and have a look. Okay, this area we're looking at, I don't know what it's called. There's no... Um, there's no... It doesn't really tell you where it is. Um, there's no... Uh, over here, this is the... It's on the north, north coast, um, northeast. You can see here, the north is is uh, that way, and um, so I don't know. And the nearest coast is is around fifty miles away. So what? Uh, there's uh, lots of stuff and all over Antarctica and I'll be exploring them all with you um, over the coming coming months. Now, bear with me, I sort of haven't really set this one up a lot, but this is the area. Now you see this line running through here. That is something we'll be having a look at. It's very unusual. Um, and there are other things other than what I'm going to be showing you in this area uh, as well. So um, there will be more videos regarding this. Now why I say alien is because it's totally relatable to the stuff we've been finding on the moons and planets in our solar system. So anything outside the Earth is alien. So we can get into all sorts of uh, theories and things here. Um, and like I normally say, or like I have said, I try not to label stuff and things like that because it just immediately puts ideas in your head and uh, you know, people want to believe something and uh, we simply just do not know for sure. Um, and I'm just going to go, I'm going to go off the back of the, the research results that I'm getting. So I don't know if you can see this here. Um, let's go in a bit further. I'm not very good with Google, I don't use it very often. Okay. 
Now, if you do, you do have a look around Antarctica and stuff, and just go and have a look at mountain ranges and things, and you'll see the difference in the qualities. Um, and uh, it's quite amazing. I was looking at one yesterday, and it has this clarity, which is pants, and then one which is absolutely beautiful. And, you know, these days I couldn't even tell you if it was CGI or not. So, you know, you have to bear all these things in mind. So, if you're use, uh, no, if you're if you're new to this, um, there are various things that you can look for in these images. And um, to me, uh, I can see them immediately. Um, and they are just areas which are blurred out. And they look a lot softer, a lot more smoky. But I'll I'll show you in the other in the images that I've. Um, worked on uh, what's going on but immediately when I looked at this area um, if you look at these which just look like snowy areas um, and because of the angle we've got on this as well you can see that these look like they are raised and um, what I'll do if I mean if you want to find this area I'm not sure how to show you the the uh, what you call it the coordinates of sorts um, and I can't get a height on this mountain if you go and look at it from another area it looks flat as a pancake so I'm not really sure how that works uh, and like I always say um, pause and just try and take the image it takes a while especially when you're looking at low quality images it just takes your your eye brain time to adjust so if we look at this area here you look at the the snow the snowy areas um, they look like to me well I'll show you in a minute they look like um, roof areas and raised areas as well um, across here there's there's one two three four five there's probably six different um, sort of terrace constructions I don't know if you can really see that on there or not always move it into a more bird's eye but you'll start seeing some weird things um, and you could say yes this is very low quality it's very you know bit mappy cuboid um, but to me it, it's not and I'll show you and like I said the reason the reason I say alien is because the similarities um, between what we're finding on the solar systems moons and uh, planets is uncanny so they're always you know that raises questions right this is on earth so uh, are there aliens on earth um, I'm going to be a bit more open I think and I believe the, the earth is saturated with them they're all over the place and are we aware of them yes we're aware of them um, very aware of them to the extent where I think um, we're probably working with them um, in various programs here on earth and in the solar system um, what that involves I have no idea um, you know and if you are interested in that sort of thing I mean I, I, I've uh, I'm not going totally going to go into it but it's through doing this I've had to rethink um, rethink your brain retrain your brain um, and I've just gone back to basics um, and uh, there's been some really interesting information I've been finding out um, from uh, you know high-ranking uh, officials operatives however you want to call them um, testimonies of um, engineers and the like which totally swear that um, 
you know, things like the Apollo program and various things like that um, have all been in colludes in conjunction with um, alien beings. So the information is out there. Um, you just have to go and find it. So this might look a bit... Uh, the hell is he talking about type sort of thing so what we'll do we'll go and have a look at and bear this groove in mind as well for a later date you see it comes through here there's some stitch marks here and originally I thought that was um, just part of the mosaic where they put it together and on Google Earth it's all it's done very badly as well so look for repetitions and stuff um, along the lines of things there's some other stuff I'll show you but there's a there's an Italian uh, outpost station and stuff I was looking at and uh, there's some good examples of that there but this I thought was a stitch mark but it turned out uh, not to be so there's some really interesting stuff here and it's all over the place not just in this area uh, okay right enough probably confused you a lot um, but yeah I mean for it to be you know on Antarctica uh, you know with the the mysteries of uh, Antarctica then uh, I believe we've got something to do with it um, and the strange thing about, you know, saying that, that you know, this is alien um, and the similarities which we've been finding, and I've mentioned it before, um, you know, is, it, it, is this a, uh, a universal, not universal, but solar system universal um, construction uh, design that is everyone's adopting um, to use our, in, in environments which are very harsh you know some of the places we're looking at you know apparently you know minus 400 you know minus 400 whatever do you know what I mean and people just say well you, you know you can't you can't live in places yeah well of course you can um, the you know the the, the engineering the construction tech that we have here and is used every day is um, just look at tunneling and stuff and things like that it, it, it is phenomenal um, you just gotta you've got to find this information out for yourself um, and over a period of time you can you make small correlations with stuff and things and you know then you start building up a picture I'm not going to fly into things you know ancient this ancient that you know it, it, you know ancient alien whatever I mean it it might seem ancient to us if you can actually get close enough to look at anything and say oh that that's ancient um, in in a, in an alien civilization which what we think is so advanced that it might just be you know a few years down the road so you just bear all that stuff you might just forget about it all and uh, work from the bottom back up with the results you're getting this is why I recommend doing this research yourself anyway I'm, I'm going on let's have a look at the enhanced version and we'll start at the top what I'll do as well, I said I was going to give this a blast. Um, oh look, there you go. I don't need to do that. Let's just go to there. I'm going to do that. And if I point this out, hopefully it'll make a bit of sense to you. So like I was saying, these white areas are the tops of, okay? Let's just say the tops. And then these, these are not necessarily the, the right colour. And what I do find um, on the, all the other stuff that I've done, that if you find a shape um, or a structure 
um, I would say 99% of the time is actually attached to something else and they, the, 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 it's been made lighter or darker just to um, fool your eye, detract it, push, push it somewhere else um, and vice versa. So, um, okay, let, let's, um, let's just, if I go, oh God. There you go, for those of you who are watching this, that's what you do if that happens, and it does happen quite a lot. Right, so if we look at this, let me do it a bit bigger. You know, if you're new to this, it's all going to look very confusing, but um, it, it's something you get used to with, um, with practice. Um, so I talk about like a tiering system. Um, the way these things constructed if you notice here as well there's a stitch line through there which breaks this area up it's just squished it a little bit by the looks but if we look here obviously this dark area here i hope you can see my cursor thing um but this looks arched and there's another area in front of it so if i just go like this So this area I'm marking now is coming out of that area. See it comes down and over here and then underneath that there is another area. This is arched over. So you have to take into account the perspectives here. So we've got one, two, three. And then there's another level. There's another hole in this area. Another covering. And then another large platform area, which splits here as well. You see it all bunched up? So we've got one, two, three, four, five. There's an open area here with structures in it. This area here. And then it's quite busy here. So if we just mark that area there, then you can see this area coming out from underneath this area. I told you it gets confusing with these markers but maybe that makes some sense and here you can actually see pieces which look like they're supporting this area. So well, let's uh, hold on get confused here right okay so that that's all i'm going to do with that so like i say pause and observe this i'll be sure i was going to show you a black and white one in this and you might be able to see a bit better so taking that into account which is something we constantly talk about when we look at these, these be it the moon, be it Mars, be it Miranda, they all have this characteristic um, style of construction. So this darker area is in, in, inside underneath this area you can see how it steps there's something i just saw there certain things that are easier to see at different levels so like i was saying before this is there's, there's nothing telling me you know what 
mountain range this is or anything so and we can see the characteristic cover-up um, uh, methods they've used with blur and stuff I don't actually think they've paid much attention to this to, to be honest I mean it was so blatant uh, and this this sort of stuff is all over the place other researchers if you're watching um, I'm presuming we're all sort of, uh, uh, part of the same community so um, if you are getting something out of this and uh, just um, give me a shout out I, I need subs I mean guys you know it's uh, it's one of those things we need subs to get the info out there um, so yeah it's a bit strange I'm a bit um, I'm a bit missed by uh, people's uh, response you know research is to research so I thought it was uh, well what I thought is uh, not what it is and that's not not what it seems anyway okay so here's another top area and you can see everything is below it or attached to it now the similarities I was talking about not only just the general construction here um, but our, our favorite little um, platforms um, and they're strange platform they, they come in square oval triangle um, and they seem to be situated every so often on these terrace um, joining um, constructions it, it it's quite hard to explain what it is but it seems to be everywhere um, now can I find any okay there's one there this area is quite interesting um, it's like a more of a an open area here um, and this comes down and then here are the more structures underneath you can see the shadow underneath you can see the 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 motion of construction the purpose of something being built this simply isn't um, rock rocks don't do this pixel anomalies compression however you want to just don't do it across the whole picture making up um, designed looking formations structures we call them formations um, but we know the structures there's no two ways about it okay so there's one of those familiar platform areas with a little dome on the top there's one here as well there's a square one there a bit on top there's more like uh, one of the cross shaped ones with a little bit on top I don't know what they are but um, look there's one there you see it it's a bit on top let's just quickly go back here And uh, should we put let's put feet or oh, kilometers kilometers okay so what's that point four two kilometer feet one thousand 
278 552 feet 152 feet not a huge area okay remember pause and take the image in so another thing is as well the way these things are all connected up This area here looks like a, a central hub of some description. Everything join it. You see this circular platform area there. You see these towers sticking up? The highlighted roofs. There's an area running around here. And this goes over it, that area goes under it. This comes round in front of it. This is the underneath. And so on and so forth. Okay, at some different levels. And for those of you who have been following the channel and seeing the the enhancements, the research, um, and what we've been talking about and stuff. How familiar does this look? So we can only but label it alien. Or alien human um, partnership, which I think is highly likely. You know, if we're finding colonies, civilizations, <coughs> excuse me, on all the planets and moons, um, and uh, we find them on Earth as well, then uh, surely we know about it, and surely we have something to do with it. And if we didn't, you know, uh, people say, well, what, you know, why don't they make themselves known? And well, that's one of the questions, isn't it? There must be a reason why it's such a big deal that we're not getting to know. Why we, we uh, possibly have uh, partnerships, relationships with these... Uh, extraterrestrial beings just trying to look at things as, as, as uh, simply as possible oh and that's what I was going to show you just then I was getting carried away so I'm not going to say much more about that, but it, 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 all, it all seems to be um, coming together. <clears throat> so we've got all the moons and planets in, in our solar system, and uh, there's so much more I'm going to show you on Earth, if I don't get shut down. Um, which... You know, it's as simple as, you know, what is, and I've heard it many a time, and I've spoken about it as well, you know, it's like they spend billions and billions and billions of uh, dollars, pounds, however, whatever currency it is, with whoever's involved in this, to go and see the same places and give us the same crap information that they have done for the past God knows how many years, and for what? Oh, um, we're going to get some minerals, um, or we're going to put a, a tent on Mars and, and try and survive. It, it, it's crap. There is a massive, the way out there, um, answer to this. And I think it's so far beyond the, the little fantasies people have. 
in ufology and, and, and things like that. Uh, which I have mentioned before, uh, which is a problem. And that's why they let people carry on, because it's all very wrong, I think. So I don't think you've heard me uh, say quite so much as, uh, as that before. So, going back to that place again. Yeah, look, it's bad quality. But here's one of those opening up platforms. Here's a little square one. There's a little... diamond shaped one they're here you can see them and then the, the, uh, you guys who have been following this you know exactly what I'm uh, talking about so immediately you would go right okay well that so they're alien and yeah how much do we actually have to do with it? And I think it's a hell of a lot more than uh, people realise. You look at this area here. This was all actually in the dark. This is all very blurred. And not so blurred. All the different colours. Um, they're, re they're not real, obviously. And the tools that I use, um, if you're not familiar with it, uh, they choose a range of pixels which you can uh, uh, decide upon. And, um, and a couple of them will really actually saturate all the colors um, out of the image so that's why I'm going to show you a black and white one as well because this could be quite confusing for you now remember if you want to do this if you want to start doing this yourself the software is free it's license free um, and there's very little to learn don't let anyone tell you this sort of stuff is difficult because it's not and uh, I will be doing a featured video with um, some uh, of I don't like to say my subs but some of the people who watch the channel and um, some of their results that's going to be very interesting I've been talking to other people as well who, who can't get any information out of any other sites regarding uh, enhancement techniques. Um, so luckily enough they found the channel and um, I've been helping them to the best of my ability. It's about disclosure and disclosure is everything and this is for people for you to learn about what is going on well what is going on it's uh there's going to be a long journey but um how to do this yourself there's some reasonable details here so it's full disclosure everything Put it this way, you can watch something and go, well, that's quite interesting, but you'll never really know. It's always in the back of your mind, you know, oh, I don't know, I don't know, that. you know, that could have come from anywhere. It's 
you don't always get all the ground information and uh, you just will never know for sure you never know for sure that I haven't mucked around with this but I, can, I will show you how to do this all questions answered the detailing here more platform areas clearly constructed I'll say inhabited but it's not clearly inhabited because I can't see anyone walking around or doing anything like that you know But let's presume it is. Look at it. So you can see the huge blurred out areas all the way, all that. And there's nothing to say that this snow is, uh, well, not snow. But there's small areas poking through, like here. Excuse me. Oh. So anyone who is doing this, uh, please do contact me and let me know how you're getting on and uh, send me some images. This is for everyone, not just special people, if you know what I'm saying. Okay, right, let's have a quick look at the black and white one, see if that helps you any other way. So pause and observe and it will slowly click into place you just got to give yourself time you see where that you can see the uh, how this area is connected right onto that little lip see a little pipe popping in an area the central hub see how that goes drops down more platform areas this looks like it's um, if I do that it could quite possibly be suspended here. Don't know for sure though. It's one of the things doing this, you can look at stuff and you go, oh that looks like that is happening, but once you actually 
research the image fully and this is what people are missing uh, you'll find it's something completely not what you expected and far more interesting and bizarre than uh, you thought initially see this area here excuse that line there I'm not doing this properly but this looks like a, a hole and like I said there's nothing to say that this isn't all part of that and this has just been airbrushed out masked up but here you see platform area and these highlight them a little bit more. You can see where this goes back underneath there. Now these areas that we're seeing here look like they could be supporting this area Look at that. See? not rocks yeah large domey thing on top So guys, don't forget to like the video and uh, definitely share it. Need to start moving this stuff around. Um, I think I'm going to do an Instagram. Uh, normally chasing who is uh, doing this as well. He's just started one, so. Um, It's like a little small group of um, researchers and we are small um, but we're moving forward very quickly as far as I'm concerned so uh, get on board more the merrier so just pull it and check it out look at this groove I was talking about you can 
comes through here. But it comes out here. So see what I'm sort of getting at? But I'll show you that at a later date. Excuse me, oh right, yeah, let's have a look at this area as well. See the mosaic line there. Oh yeah, this image is taken by, I was going to show you some pictures, um, but they've got so many satellites. That, um, I couldn't be bothered. It's uh, Maxmar Technologies who um, took this image, not a Landsat one. Um, they're worth looking into. I think they're not, don't quote me, uh, I think they're Chinese, owned by the Chinese, run by someone else. So, yeah, bear in mind what. Um, I said or don't bear it in mind just start from the beginning and come to your own conclusions but I think it's very it's very simple um, you know we're, we're now there's there's no two ways about it that all the um, as far as we know so far that the moons and planets are colonized um, just as is the earth you see So, I'll leave it with you. Tell me what you think about this. Uh, I've got loads more of this uh, coming up. So, I um, hope you enjoyed it. I hope it wasn't too long. And uh, and I hope some of you are interested enough to uh, take on this journey yourself. And um, be part of it. Okay, thanks a lot. And goodbye.